Hey marketers! Today, I'm going to be showing you how to use some of HubSpot's AI tools to automate marketing tasks, save time, and get better results without extra effort. Let's dive in. The first thing I want to talk about is HubSpot's AI Content Assistant. This can help you create marketing copy in just seconds, and whether you need a blog post, an email, or maybe a social media post, this AI tool can help you speed up that process. So let's just imagine that I want to create a LinkedIn post about an upcoming webinar. Let's see how AI can help us do that. Uh, so in our HubSpot demo portal, um, we're going to come over to marketing and we're going to go to social. This is where all the social tools are housed. Um, and we're going to create a new post. We do not have uh, any accounts currently connected to HubSpot, but we can still use the AI tools to help us draft up some, some responses. So down here in the draft, um, you'll see this star. Now, anywhere you see this star in HubSpot is going to allow you to access Copilot, which is the uh, AI tool that HubSpot has overlaid on their software. So let's click this and we're going to ask it to help us generate a social post. So you can see it kind of pops up here and it says, you know, kind of prompts you there. So I have a, a prompt pre-written. Um, but like I like I said, let's mention that we uh, want to do a LinkedIn post on an AI webinar that's coming up. So if we say write us a LinkedIn post, it's important to mention what platform you're writing it for. Um, promoting an upcoming webinar on AI and marketing, make it engaging and make it have a CTA. We want it to have a call to action at the end. So let's see what it spits out for us. Perfect. It's already working for us, right? Um, we have some emojis, uh, it even put us, uh, a placeholder to add a link and it even gave us some hashtags that we can utilize if we want to. Now, um, you can see here that it gives us an option to refine. So let's say we read this and we're like, oh shoot. Um, I forgot to, um, please include, uh, a mention of a guest speaker and we'll just use, uh, John heritage. Who's the even bound president. Let's see what it does for us. Uh, perfect. So it's rewriting the content. Um, and let's just do a quick high level overview. Yes. Perfect. So it says. Um, don't miss out on insights from industry leaders who are shaping the future of marketing, including our esteemed guest speaker, John Heritage, a renowned expert in AI applications. So that helped us refine our social posts a little bit more. Now, easy enough, we can just copy it, paste it in here, and we could add media, we could schedule it out, and AI just helped us create a very engaging social post in just a couple of seconds. Uh, so as you can see, the speeding up of the content creation, and even more importantly, the ability to refine to make sure that things stay engaging and they stay on brand. Let's take a look at HubSpot's AI-powered workflows and how they can help automate follow-ups, lead nurturing, and other customer interactions. Let's say that someone um, who attended our webinar, we also want to send them an ebook um, about AI and marketing if they have opted in. Uh, we can use HubSpot's workflows as well as the AI tool to help us do that especially if we don't have a lot of experience setting those up on our own. Let's take a look. Uh, workflows are under automations in HubSpot. So go to automations and go to workflows. Here you can see, again, all the demo ones that we have set up. But for this instance, we're going to start one from scratch. Um, because again, we are new to this um, in this example, and we, are, uh, we don't have anything to go off of. So let's start from scratch. Um, and it brings us here, right? Very basic workflow. Um, so now first things we need to do is we need to say, what's that criteria for us to enroll contacts into this workflow? Now, we know what we want to do, but we might not know how to set it up um, in HubSpot quite yet. So let's use AI to help us do that. Now I have a prompt pre-save so that I know um, what we're doing here. We don't have to waste time on that. But um, I basically said, when someone fills out the AI marketing um, ebook form, let's send them an automated email. So let's generate the trigger and let's see what HubSpot does for us. Perfect. So now we can see that um, the enrollment criteria for this workflow is they have to, the contact has to have completed a form submission. Um, and that form name is AI in marketing ebook. So we didn't have to go through and select any of this, go through any of the prompts. AI tool just did it for us. So that's awesome. So it gives us an opportunity to keep this trigger. If we want to keep it, great. If not, we can uh, try and reframe the, the AI prompt. Um, but since that got it right, we are going to keep it. Now, the second part of this is going to be creating an email. So let's look at how, um, again, another instance of the AI content um, bot 
And let's see how we can create an email around that. Um, so let's go to create a new email. Um, we are going to use this as automation. Again, this is um, one step further, but I think it'll help you understand how uh, these AI tools can help make things um, easier. So again, let's just say um, we are using this for the AI ebook um, that we were just talking about in the form. And let's use AI. So as I mentioned, the star is always going to be HubSpot's co-pilot and going to help you get to the um, AI tool to help you uh, generate responses. So in this case, um, uh, help me create an email that we are sending to people who opted to download our AI in marketing ebook. Perfect. Um, let's refine it a little bit and let's say, please include subject line and sign off. Perfect. Now it's got the entire thing here um, and we can just copy and paste it over. So let's copy it. Let's paste it. And we all have to do a little bit of formatting here since that put the subject line um, within this copy. But essentially, there we go. We have a subject line, um, we have the body copy, and then we have our personalization tokens down on the bottom. So just in less than three minutes, we created a workflow from AI and we created the uh, email body copy to go along with it, saving us a ton of time. Lastly, let's look at HubSpot's AI-powered blog and website content generator. This is perfect for long-form content, like a blog. Uh, so let's just say I want to write a blog about AI trends in marketing. Let's see how AI can help us do that. Um, coming back over here to the content tab, um, we're going to go to the blog. Um, again, this tool is similar in for landing pages and website content in general. We're just going to use a blog for this example. Um, up at top, you can create a blog or you can start with AI. So let's do that. Um, what you'll see right out of the gate is it first will start by giving you a couple ideas if you don't have any. Um, like I said, we do have some, so I actually have a prompt prepared. Um, as I mentioned, we are going to talk about AI and how it's changing B2B marketing um, in 2025. So I put a little bit of context in here. Um, I said the tone should be professional and conversational, um, similar to a HubSpot style blog. We want it to be educational, informative, action-driven. Um, it should be designed for B2B marketers, executives, and business owners looking to understand how AI is reshaping uh, marketing strategies in 2025. So we could say we want to um, focus on AI in B2B um, marketing as our core keyword. Let's just see what that gets us. Um, target's going to be the U.S. Uh, you can upload files and documents if you want to give it some additional uh, context to what you want to write. I don't have any for this, so we're going to leave that blank. And then for us, we are just going to go to we're going to go to manufacturing um, because we said B two B and marketing, or I'm sorry, uh, manufacturing and industrial is um, one of our core industries that we like to focus on. So let's see what we come up with. So it's going to do some work here. It's going to first give us some ideas on a blog post title. It's also going to give us some uh, indication of what it is like to um, rank um, and how many searches there are per month and things along those lines. So let's go with the highest monthly search volume, uh, leveraging AI content generators for B2B success in 2025. Let's start with that. And it looks like you can also um, add more titles if you don't see anything there. Um, and then the really nice thing is it's going to give you an outline first before it actually writes. So you can refine that outline, maybe have your team look at that outline and make sure that all the content there is good um, and so on and so forth. So let's see what we've got here. We've got a blog description. Um, we're going to have it use AI generated image with this post. Um, also gives a description of the image, uh, futuristic image showcasing a robotic arm interacting with a digital interface, symbolizing synergy between AI manufacturing. Okay, uh, let's see what it gives us. Um, and then paragraph headers, um, it's going to talk, show us what each of those are. And then if we wanted to, we could do add talking points underneath those. So if we're like, yes, this is right, but make sure you touch on this, this, and this, we can do that. Or if there's additional paragraph headers we want to create content for, we can do that as well. 
for the example, we aren't going to do that, but let's see what we get in response. Now, while this is loading, one thing I just want to remind you all is AI is a super powerful tool, but it also is not always going to be 100% accurate, right? It is using what it knows to create this. We at Evenbound always recommend that you have a human oversight, whether that's a content writer, whether that's a subject matter expert in what you're writing about, always have a set of eyes on it to review and refine to ensure that the information that's going out is 100% accurate. Um, great. So it generated a blog post for us. Let's take a look. So we've got some of our um, our demo portal items up here, but let's see what it generated for us. So we can see that AI image that it generated, which actually looks fairly good in my opinion. Um, it gave us a quick title here, and then it gave us our entire blog. So enhancing content creation efficiency um, as we move through the digital age, perfect. Um, driving personalization and B2B communications. Um, optimizing SEO strategies. So you can see it really gave us um, a really good uh, starting point here. Personally, I would do a little bit more refinement and add some lists, add some bullet points, um, maybe add some more clear calls to action. But as you can see, the purpose of this, we've created a very good blog post that is on brand, um, has a very good structure. And we only did that in you know less than three minutes. So very good tool. As always, make sure that you have some human insight on the back end of that before we go live. But again, this tool is really, really great for overcoming a writer's block um, or really just speeding up any content creation you have to do in general. And that's it. HubSpot AI tools make marketing easier by handling content, automation, and email copy all in one platform. If you're already using HubSpot, try out these AI features and let me know which one saves you the most time. And then drop a comment below or reach out if you have any questions and see you next time.